Slam channel. Hope y'all had a great weekend. We got some KBO games for Tuesday, June 11th. Recap of our last week. We ended up going 5 of 6 for back-to-back -back weeks. Five winning days, one missed day. That is impressive, especially given it's KBO, one of the toughest sports to put slips in. But 5 of 6, definitely we're running into profit back-to-back -back weeks. Unfortunately, the only odd thing is the two days that we miss is the last day of the week. Uh, so hopefully we can improve on that. Uh, but I'll take 5 of 6 any day, any day of the week. So let's get started. I do have three props today. I do have four that I'm going to share with, but I'm going with three. The three-man flex has been great to me since the past three weeks. I'm going to be sticking to them. Uh, but one of them is questionable. I'm pretty sure the public is going over on Andrew Anderson with the pitcher strikeouts. Many of the public, or at least general public, is taking the under. I'm going to be doing the opposite, but I will give you another prop if you completely want to fade that. Uh, I'm just taking the risk. It is gambling, so I'll be taking the risk for that. Uh, but let's get started. I'll be going with the play of the day. First one for me will be Juan Dun Ha. Four strikeouts. I'll be taking the under, going against the SSG Landers. Reliever turned into starter and seven starts this season. He's only gone over once. Uh, so I'll be taking the under on his four strikeouts. Last time he did face against the SSG Landers uh, a month ago, he only had three strikeouts. Needs five to beat us. Uh, worst case scenario pushes, but I have him projected to get three once again. Uh, so I'll be taking the under on that. That is my favorite one of the board today. Second one I'll be taking, I'll be taking Denny Reyes. Um, I'm going to be taking his pitcher strikeouts at four. Usually his line is at five or 5.5. This is the lowest I've seen it. Yes, he is going against the LG Twins, the first place team. Uh, but he's gotten over in 13 starts. He's gotten over eight of those 13. Last time he faced the, NG, uh, the LG Twins, he went. He got five. Uh, obviously, we need four to push, but we need five to win. I think he can get to that. He is a workhorse. He does pitch deep into the game. Uh, so I'll be taking the over. His hits allowed is not bad at 6.5. We want to take the over. Uh, but I just prefer his pitcher strikeouts at four. We do have that push equity. So I'll be taking the more on that. Then I'll be taking the controversial pick for my third leg is andrew anderson i'm going to be taking the more going against the kia tigers the kia tigers are slumpy right now they are in second place they lost their first place position to the lg twins seven strikeouts yes it is a lot he needs eight he's from probably the farthest pitcher him and james naley uh to get double digit strikeout games the history with andrew anderson he's only making his sixth start this season he's fairly new to the kbo He's 3-for-3 three three in those three starts. Uh, two of those starts, he was being stretched out. Not sure if he was coming off of injury or just new to KBO. Uh, but those three starts in the beginning, he only went three or four innings. And one of those games, he did pitch against the Kia Tigers. And in three innings, he had six strikeouts. Uh, he had scoreless gem, uh, three innings. I think they were stretching him out. He was on pitch limit. Uh, but I, I see him going six, seven innings. He's been averaging that in the past three starts. He has, he's coming back from a game where he had 10 Ks, 8 Ks, and 7 Ks. So going against the Kia Tigers, I think he's going to get there. If he pitches five innings, he should easily clear this line. Uh, so I'll be taking the over on that. If you want to fade this prop, the best one you can take for that one to replace is Guac Bin's hits allowed at five. And 13 starts, he's allowed eight of those 13. So it has the same probability as the Danny Reyes pitcher strikeouts. If you want to completely play Andrew Anderson, I just feel for the fact that I'm picking Andrew Anderson is I think one of these pots might push. So I'm just going for the straight win and hopefully I go for two for three or two and two with the push. Uh, make sure you flex it. Don't power any of these, especially in KBO. Uh, but if you need a fourth one, or just another one to replace Andrew Anderson. Guac Bin is your best one for hits allowed. But I'll be going with these three. So I think these are the ones we'll hit. Huang Don Ha, less pitcher strikeouts. Danny Reyes, more pitcher strikeouts. And Andrew Anderson for more pitcher strikeouts. So mix or match, pick your favorite. I did offer four props. All four of them have good probability to hit. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Appreciate the support. We'll see you guys in the next one.